Good morning, what's up everyone? Happy Wednesday is today. We had like school off, it's Wednesday because we had school off Monday and Tuesdays. But this morning I'm back at the gym with Emma. She probably has been working out over the weekend. Me, I haven't because I was feeling sick. Insert clip here of me being sick and trying to walk. So it is true, I'm still sick. But I feel like today was like the worst day for it. So I feel like it's, well, my hair is so long. I just wanted to rest. I had the sustainable straw, so I was like super busy last week. But now it's back to the gym. Something I've been doing also, which has been honestly really helpful for like school and like focusing with like work and throughout the day. Um, I've been taking these shots called, they're like productivity elixirs um, by this company called Magic Mind. This is what they look like. There's four components um, to the shot that actually make it good for productivity. Nootropics, which is for focus. Matcha for energy, obviously. Adaptogens, which are like, they reduce your stress. Um, and then like a huge complex of vitamins for like immunity. And I've been taking it for a couple days and I feel like it really has, you know, increased my productivity and focus like at school and work. And it's honestly really yummy. Like it kind of tastes like pineapple and it's so small. It's like all of those good things in this tiny little bottle. So I really enjoyed taking these and I'm going to bring one to the gym for Emma to try too. We are at the gym. You guys know Emma. Hi. <laughs> We're taking these magic, magic mind, mind shots. <laughs> B12. B3, B2, B3. Basically everything that gives you mental clarity and focus. Focus. Energy. And you know we need this before the gym and before our very busy day. Yeah. Let's do it. It does smell good. Koala? Mmm. Yeah. Passion fruit. Okay. If you guys want to get some, link in bio with the discount code. Okay guys, I'm back at my house and I'm busy getting ready. I still have to do like my makeup and my hair, but this is my outfit. Got this white skirt, this shirt for Valentine's Day that says me plus you equals heart. My, um, this jacket that I thrifted in Madrid and then my socks. This is my little updated morning routine. I've got my CeraVe dupe from Walgreens, just like the PM moisturizer. I'm running out, so yes, this is how, this is how I'm applying it. Um, be a hater if you want, but this is how you get the most product out of your moisturizer. My face gets kind of red when I rub things into it, but the next thing is my Clear Face Neutrogena sunscreen. Since I was like 19, I have been wearing moisturizer basically every single day of my life. I mean, oh my god, of course moisturizer, but sunscreen because I just feel like it makes my skin more even toned. It adds that like zinc that I feel like it needs. Next, I'm gonna put on the number seven um, concealer. Just in a couple of places, as you can see, I have a few little pimples that are ailing me. Yes, this is just the life of being a girl in her 20s. Sometimes you get pimples. Anyways, um, I have that one video of Miranda Cosgrove that they turned into, that like somebody turned into like a meme and it was like, I actually do cuss a little. And then the interviewer is like, oh, what do you say? What's your favorite cuss word? And she's like, probably fuck. Ha, ha, ha. And she goes, ah, probably fuck. And she just says that like, I don't know why it's stuck in my head, but I think it's so fucking funny. Every time I hear it, it makes me laugh so hard. You guys know the sound I'm talking about. Probably fuck. I can't believe that like era of Nickelodeon. I think about that sometimes and I'm like, wow, like that we lived through, like we were watching something that had never been done before and we loved it. Like everybody I know was obsessed with like Victorious and iCarly and just like the random, the randomness, like that, ra it, it was like the era of like random. I feel like that age, like the more random something was, the funnier it was, like that was our humor. And I just remember loving it. Like, I loved it. Um, then I'm probably just going to do my eyebrows with this gel that I got on Amazon. This eyebrow gel. Ugh. Probably fuck. Um, 
and I just go like that. I'm pretty sure I've done this on this channel before. I need to do that eyebrow trick again where I like line my eyebrows and then like pluck everything that's not in the lines because they're kind of bothering me. Like I look at them and I'm like, okay, these are not normal right now. Like I think I plucked too much right here the last time I did it or like cut. Like it doesn't look normal right there. Ugh. And I fear I don't have enough time to make them look normal this morning. I am so excited for summer. You guys literally have no idea. Even spring break. I'm so there's so many things that I'm excited about better than sex. Um I'm like ecstatic about just like the night what the next six months honestly the rest of this i'm just excited about this year honestly is what it is i have so much fun stuff happening this year so much to look forward to and great experiences to have so i'm just like lit like i'm so grateful for everything that's gonna happen this year fingers crossed but spring break is gonna be so fun i'm driving with my friends to florida um, we're gonna go camping at the beach and I cannot wait so yeah that's my little makeup routine I don't know where to look when I film on this I'm gonna sure look directly at the lens or should I look in the screen let's go make some breakfast make oatmeal <clears throat> I do blueberries peanut butter a banana walnuts and a little bit of jam to like sweeten it up um so I'm gonna do that this morning I also want to make a little coffee so I'm using the breakfast blend oh that was the last one I used the Keurig because my my 99 cream look Still coffee taste test. Mm. Usually I get the full fat oat milk because I feel like it's the most similar to um, regular milk in terms of like how it like acts in things. But I got like the regular fat one um, and it's like okay. Like it's okay in coffee. This is the oatmeal. It's spring on campus, kind of. I just got ready to go to the climbing gym with Leon. And I went and reached into my laptop bag and my mom hid this over the weekend. There's um, like milk chocolate covered macaroons with like this very sweet little note. That's so cute for my mom and dad. Aww. Happy Valentine's Day. <laughs> for Valentine's Day this year, I got Leon these really pretty flowers. This little vase. And I made this cute card um, with his Valentine's Day gift inside, which is two tickets to Peel's collage night. But I made the tickets myself, so... The collage night is basically what it sounds like. You go to this place and they have like um, all the like materials you need to like make your own little collages. So I think it'll be really fun for us to do together. I went to one before, but he didn't come with and I think that he would really enjoy it, so. Leon loves his flowers. Wow, I love flowers. He's so happy, but I, I have something else so for him. Happy. I love the <laughs> I have something. Yeah.
Yep. To be fair, it's pretty good though. Mm -hmm.